And we're back. All right. I uh, I moved my mic around, so please let me know if it's ridiculously loud or weird or whatever. I think it'll help. I think it'll be better. But it might be way too much gain. Is that better? I think that's better. Good morning. Oh, okay. I thought it was my mic being weird. I was all confused. <laughs> I was like, but you had no problem earlier. <laughs> that makes that makes a lot more sense. Stretch. Can I turn that on here? Sorry, I just had a weird thought about something that's been bothering me. 
about the way this looks on screen. So try to figure out if I can turn that on. Maybe this is what I want. Yes, this is what I want. Awesome. Yeah. So now I should stay in the middle. Perfect. This is exactly what I wanted. <laughs> Now it should be easier to follow because then at least it's not gonna like keep going to the bottom of the screen. Makes a lot more sense. Cool. Okay. As usual, I'm totally in my zone, but if you do have any questions or um, if there's anything you'd like to know, feel free to interrupt me. I'm always happy to answer questions. 
Uh, and I'm always happy to give this disclaimer. Uh, so I know people don't like interrupting. Um, but honestly, I'm, I'm here to learn just as much as, uh, as you guys are. So let's have, let's have conversations. Oh, um, yeah, it's, um, it's on my Discord. So that's a link to my Discord. It's in the file share, which you guys should be able to see. Should be there. If it's not, let me know and I will see what can be done. I think I had it on the wrong thing there. <laughs> Well, I think I had it set up wrong, so that should that should have fixed it. Uh, I'm working on the short story that I started ages ago. Um, the one that I promised I would write only on stream. <laughs> I've kept that promise. I have. Uh, it's been it's been a long road. 
Uh, but it's getting close to completion. I'm hoping that I can finish it uh, between this week and next week. I'm hoping I can get it pretty much close to, to done. Um, yeah. That's my plan. <laughs> That's my plan.
All right, so now I have to come up with a better logical process here. And by logical process, I mean I need to figure out how to get Hyperinor's mind from point A to point B. Hmm. <sighs> oh, that's an interesting idea. What if uh, Zodnik was the one who made her arm?
Hey, what's up? This program is called Scrivener. Uh, it's a software design for writing. Uh, no, I don't have a thing for that. Oh, I do. Nightbox is a little, a little behind. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, it's a little different. It's designed to be um, it's designed so that you can break up your uh, what you're doing into a lot of little pieces and and keep them all in kind of one thing, so you can work on all of them at the same time. Um, it's very useful. Uh, and much and mu well, it's much more useful in my opinion than like just a straight word editor. Though there's nothing wrong with just using a word editor. Sometimes it's nice to have that simplicity of just I, I'm gonna do one thing here, and that's that's that. <laughs> I hate using things full screen. I, I don't like it. I don't. I don't like it. Not to mention my full screen actually doesn't fit on the uh, on the screen properly. Yeah, I don't like it. <laughs> Interesting. Interesting. I hadn't thought about that, but I suppose it gives you options to customize everything, right? So you'd be able to customize the full screen.
I I don't like colors. I like black and white, and I like black background, and white text. But yeah, maybe that's something I should think about. I don't know. I don't really like full screen though. Um, I like having the side by side too much. A few other things. Trying to consider this. Wait, have I been spelling this wrong the entire time? Oh god.
I have been. Oh my god. That's wonderful. bad. <laughs> uh, amateur hour over here. It's a good one. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Uh, but I did that. I've, I've been doing that for uh, a while now. So all of the projects I've created uh, since I got this computer uh, in January uh, are on black and white. And I think some of the older ones are too. You, uh, you can, Erica. I think you gotta use the, um, the, like, project templates and design your project template to have the colors built in in that way. Or maybe I'm wrong. Hey, what's up, Disney?
does make me curious though. If I open up something really old. Uh, not that old. Oh, well, that opens pretty much how I want it. Don't know. I'm not a big changer. I just, uh, I prefer to f figure out what works and just leave it rather than changing it per project. Um, but you know, to each their own. Uh, basically what you do, um, I haven't done a ton of it, but basically what you do is you set up your options and you hit save as template. Um, I believe uh, Anthony Johnson has a thing on that, uh, on making templates. I read one somewhere about it. <laughs> This is the this is where I found out about Courier Prime as well, because I hated Courier for a long time, and then I got Courier Prime, and now I love Courier. That's all I use. There's a I know there's a, a good tutorial on it. I'm just not sure where it is. That, uh, that moment where you realize you've subconsciously been doing everything this other guy on the internet recommended without even thinking about it. <laughs> He's like, yeah, I don't use this and this and this. It's like, I don't use any of those either. That makes so much sense. You do exactly the same way I do. Uh, anyway, random.
page 13 of 18. My edited notes here. Making some good progress because I'm not sure we're going to do the last scene yet. Um, so I don't know if you were, if any of you here were there for the last time I was working on it. Uh, but I wasn't sure if the ending I had written was the right ending for the story. It felt very out of place to me. And I've been considering it for quite some time now, and I still haven't come up with a clear answer for what I want the actual ending to be. But yeah, it's one of those things that it's hard to say. I know why it feels weird. I think there needs to be a, a scene after the one that I'm at. Oh, hey, Johnny. You're, stop you're, you're not lurking anymore? I, I saw you sitting there. That's the coolest spelling of Socrates ever. Well, the nerdiest spelling of it, but by D, uh, well, I don't know. I was making a joke there and some, somehow and failed, which is not that surprising. <laughs> uh, not a funny person. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hey, Mikael. What's up, man? <laughs> oh, boy. It's a stream. It is indeed a stream. I could be wrong now. I've been wrong before. I said you were an expert, but you, uh, 
but you struggle at shortcuts and file menus because you're not used to the English version. Not what I want to say, but it is the closest to it that I can think of at the moment. So it's going to stay. Alright, uh, it's just after two, I'm going to take another quick break, uh, and then come back. Pretty sure we're going to get this scene done today. I always struggle with dialogue, so dialogue's the thing that I kind of get hung up on the most. And then what to put in between dialogue to break it up, or make it interesting, or, you know. Sometimes I feel like I'm way too logical with it, where it's like, I want to know exactly what everyone's doing, when and how, and how they're reacting, and the little moments in between, and I don't know, thinking about it. So yeah, I'm going to take another break. <laughs> 